Whatever is the matter? I have been intercepting nothing but poppycock propaganda about soothing, syrup and whatnot. No, I swear to high heavens, if Starrick's monopoly continues... Alec, I beg your pardon. These are friends of mine. Evie Fry and her brother, Jacob. Oh, um... Alexander Graham Bell. Linguist, inventor and technical expert. Alec, I have something of a favor to ask you. Can you fix this? Oh, looks like the casing is cracked. Oh, comes apart. <laughs> I see. Could have used one of these to fit my fuses on top of Big Ben. Alec is installing a new telegraph line for our Free Press Association. To combat the Static Telegraph Company. Now, if I can mend the fuses connecting independent lines from Big Ben, Static will be weakened. Only we are somewhat at a handicap. Hmm. And there. Oh, I've removed the mechanism, so it may work with the operator. I'll put it to use immediately. <laughs> Jacob, wait. Mr. Bell, allow me to help you with your fuses. Oh, you will not find me too proud to accept Miss Fry. Oh, uh, we can use my carriage, if you'd be so good as to hold the reins off. I'll take that. Um, I, I can help you. Hello, and welcome back to the next episode of our Blind Let's Play of Assassin's Creed Syndicate. We are doing Freedom of the Press, which is sequence 3 for Evie. Oh, good gravy. You expect me to drive. This is not going to go well. Phonetic telegraph. Hmm. Sounds a bit of a mouthful. You could just call it a telephone. Telephone. <laughs> People kick it off the sidewalk anyway, if you don't mind. Which is why Mr. Green has asked you to set up a free line. Yes. What is more, other small independent companies have their lines sabotaged, and they have little means of finding any broken fuses, which are. To be found on top of Big Ben. Correct. Especially as one needs a special government pass to get through the guards. Well, then, they will not be a problem. I'll repair the fuses. All right. Well, that was quite crazy and a weird opening to the episode. But we do have a rape launcher. Very cool. I am looking forward to using this. Hopefully, it will. Holy bobbles help us get up there so install the fuses without going below 30 feet in altitude all right let's give it a try holy heck this building is quite impressive though look at the detail of the carving it's amazing keep going Evie we got this Yeah, that's a long climb up, isn't it? Holy heck. That's quite impressive. Are we right here? There we go. Nice. And I think this is a sink point as well, so we might as well do that while we're here. There we go. Lovely is it, view. or can we? Is it a sink point? No, maybe not. So we just need to go to our next one. Oh, it looks like we have a DNA helix thing here too. Now, how are we going to do this without going down thirty feet? All right, we have arrived at our second one. And now we can head off All to set. the third one. 
see. I think we can just L1 it over there. Ooh, I got a glitch. Nice. Can I keep going? Oh, this thing is really fun, guys. I am enjoying this. Ah, there we go. Nice. That's so much easier than climbing up the side of the building, I must say. Here we go. A little bit more, and we are there. There we go. Alright, so that we got all the fuses it. in. Now we need to speak with Alexander Graham Bell. And of course, he is all the way back over there. So I will meet you guys once I am closer to him. Alright, here we go. We are back to Alexander Graham Bell. Thank you very much, Miss Fry. I will now be able to continue with the installation of the new line. If there's anything else I can do to help... Uh, certainly. Please do come and visit. Oh, uh, I was toying with this device and have noted down the formula for you. It, it's not perfect yet, but by golly, it works. No, oh, nice. <laughs> I like him. Alright, so we did that. Oh, it looks like we have some things over that we can loot. 200 and air assassinate. A guard? Ooh, I don't know. Oh, maybe one of the guards over here. So let's go ahead and run over here and do this real quick on our way back. Oh, wow. That is a busy, busy place. And dang, those ships move fast. Suggested level four. We are level three. Although we may have some upgrades available to us. I'm not sure. I should probably check that. Like we have a helix thing underneath the bridge. We'll get that at another time. All right, so we are up here above the area. So if we go like this, now how do we? Ah, like that. Now, if we come like this, can we get him? Can we get one of them to come over to us? Yeah, it looks like the big boy's gonna do it. Come here. You gonna come here? Nope. Apparently, we just needed to go to him. Okay, so he's dead. And we just need you. There we go. Get the chest. Is that all I needed? I think so. Looks like we just need to head over to this other one now. Are you... Over here? Whoa. I see you. Let's go around this way. Oh, I see that helix thing up there too. I'll probably come... Get it here in a minute. Here. Why don't I come over there and 
teach you a lesson. Okay. Go ahead, come and do it. Can he hear me? There we go. No, I think he knows I'm here. Ah, uh, now he doesn't. There we go. Well, shh. Yeah, why don't you? Yeah, come here. There, we got him. Now we just need this last guy. Is it just... No, there's... Ooh, there's two of them. Hmm... Got that one. Got that one. And we got that one. Nice. And now we can do crafting. Nice. But I think we are... Good, right? Yeah, we don't have any money. I used it for upgrades and stuff. But I think we can actually stand up. Is that up above me? Or is it down below? Oh, there it is right over there. So if I mark it there, can I go? No. Nope. Alright, I'll come back and deal with that later. I am not in the mood to uh, mess with those. Can we get off? Can I? not do that. I wanted to sneak over and kill this person. Good gravy. They had a sniper up here. We'll just, uh, do that real quick. Nice. Alright, now we are just above Bell's workshop. So all we need to do is get it down, and we should be done. There we go. Ah, Miss Fry. Uh, I was just showing Jacob the first message was received via the mended lines. Oh, uh, you can keep the rope launcher, by the way. Um, we've managed to procure another one for your brother. Excellent work. Thank you. Again. You're very welcome, Mr. Bell. We can now defend the principle of impartial news and free speech. <laughs> free is fair, but free and brief is far better. Ha <laughs> ha! Ah, Fry, such caustic wit. <laughs> and on that note, we must depart. <laughs> oh, uh, good fortune to you both. Uh, call on me! Uh, uh, Any time! <laughs> He's cute. All right, let's continue on. All right, guys, so I'm not quite sure what has happened, but I've gotten switched over to these stories of London. I'm not sure, but apparently we're going to be doing the crate escape next. It says Evie has a lead to the location of the Templar's piece of Eden. I actually wanted to do one of Jacob's quests, but it won't let me switch over to him. So I'm not quite sure what is going on with that. But uh, let's go ahead and give this one a try. Ah, another exciting night home for Evie Fry. 
Just on my way out, actually. I found the piece of Eden. What's this one going to do, hmm? Heal the sick? Deflect bullets? Control the populace? They're dangerous objects, Jacob, especially in Templar hands. Oh, you sound exactly like father. If only. Lucy Thorne is expecting a shipment tonight. She's Starek's expert in the occult. I'm nearly certain she is receiving the piece of Eden Sir David Brewster mentioned. Sounds like fun. Mind if I join you? Promise you will stick to the mission. I swear. The contents of that box are worth more than your life and those of your entire family. Do you understand? Yes, Miss Thorne. Uh, careful there! And double the guard on that cart! Now, Miss Thorne, there's the matter of some uh, papers for Mr. Starek. If you'll just come this way. Very well, but make it quick. She's quite Whatever pleasant, she isn't she? In that chest. There are gunmen on the rooftops. Can you dispose of them before I reach the cart? I was hoping for a challenge. Alright. Well, we'll take our uh, quickie travel. I love this thing. Whatever they call it. The rope thing? I don't know. Works for me. Can I like just drop down there? Oh, is there anyone around it? No, there's no one around it. Okay. Well, there sort of is. Oh, he's right over there. Oh. There we go. You're dead. Who else? Can I get you guys? There we go. Oh, we got the police involved. Okay, did I mean to do that? Oh. Come on. Oh, I gotta... Oh, jeez. Alright, well, this has just not gone the way I wanted it to. Get out! Shooting me, thank you. Well, is that all of them? Jeez. Holy heck. Somebody's still trying to shoot me. From where? I don't know. No, I didn't want to carry him. Drop him. I want to get in here. Really, where are you? Oh, you. Um. There you go. You'll feel better now. Did you find it? Actually. I think it's best we leave. What did you do? It's hardly the time for questions. Whoa! Come on! Half time I was gone. Then where's your okay. piece of Eden? Get us out of this and I might find out! Come All right. Jacob, stop it! 
Oh, they're gonna be coming soon. Come on, Jacob, hurry up. Let's get out of this place. Well, yep, there they are. There's one. Nope. Ouch. Here we go. Ouch, jeez. Yep. Oh, hey, dude. Yeah, I am not getting this gun thing. Oh, hey, dude. Whoa, what happened? Why will it not? I'm not getting the gun. Oh well, I killed the horse. That will work. Whoa. Get out, get out, get out. I think we did it. Yep. <laughs> well, that was fun. Thanks for the invitation. Let's do it again. Damn it. Nice. So we finished that. Camden Loch and my wee sister the seamstress did a discount on the curtains nice looks very nice indeed all right guys this is where I'm going to leave it for the day. A little bit of a discombobulated episode, but we've gotten a few things accomplished, and I hope you guys have enjoyed. So, as always, thank you all so very much for joining me today, and I will see you in the next one.